today we're in Osaka and we're exploring Denden Town, which is the Osaka version of Akihabara, where you can find all anime merch, figures, manga, games, and all that stuff. And also lots of arcades with UFO catchers and things. It's not as big as Akihabara, and from what I've heard, it's a bit more spread out, so the shops are dotted around everywhere. There's a lot of cosplay stuff over here. 49,000 yen, 40,000 yen, 18,000, 12,000, 56,000. It's quite a price range. <laughs> Cosplay supplies. Oh, here's some persona cosplayers. P4. Yep. Okay. Here's some contact lenses. <laughs> Cake cases for your contact lenses, that's really cute. Body suit. Makeup. Ah, oh, these are cosplays for your doll. That's cute. There's also several electronic shops. This one's selling PCs and hardware for gaming. So it's a lot more specialist than going somewhere like PC World or a general computer shop. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> it's like Josie and the Pussycats but the mouse version. <laughs> They've got a lottery for the Idol Master or Mikuji. 500 yen per play, and you win one of those key rings. <laughs> and at the bottom of the arcade, we found lots of Gachapon. I'm gonna go for sweet ice ham. I always love the cafe de Hamus. Yeah, what? <laughs> What's going on there? <laughs> oh, they're all cute, aren't they? I like this one. It's like he's being squashed. Oh, that one. The matcha oh, ice oh, cream. Cool. He's giving it a bite. <laughs> we'll have to get a oh, look, they've got it's got little hamster heads on the stick. That's attention to detail. It's 200 yen. Oh. oh, it's the biscuit one. Yeah, that's the one I wanted. You're getting one as well, Phil? Yeah. <laughs> Maybe you'll get the one you wanted as well. I like most of them, as long as I don't get those two now. Yeah. They always do two versions that are the same, oh, but just different I colours, think don't they? Pink bottom. Is it? Oh, no, it is. It's the... Uh... Oh, is it the one you wanted? The vanilla version, instead of the matcha. I think. Can't tell. Well, that's good. It's just as good, isn't it? Fussy. <laughs> 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 I think you magically get your first choice every time. <laughs> yeah, if you get the ice cream ones, you can put them on your keys. So they're they're, oh, they're keychains. The they're got not all keychains. Key yeah. Unless you had a tiny drill. But this one does come with the little ice cream scoop. Oh, that looks so easy to lose. That's tiny. <laughs> <laughs> There's a little garden of gachapon outside. <laughs> Oh, 
the squishy gyoza. Cute little clips. <laughs> oh, I don't like the ones in my video. The lights. Drink can lights. Oh, yeah, these have seemed quite cheap for Gachapon. Usually they're 300. Here's the supermarket meat department. <laughs> Petrol cans. Squishies. You can put them in water. I'm not sure what the deal is with that. Taps. Hongari toast pochi. I think they're also pockets. pockets. Wow, it's actually useful. <laughs> and here's the famous hats for cats. There's so many series of this one. And at the moment they've got a theme cafe in Harajuku of this. Usagi soft dot, soft cream. Squishy pizza. Fruit on a keychain. If you like my videos, you can support Cakes With Faces by buying something from my shop, cakeswithfaces.co.uk. They're all my original designs and lots of them are inspired by my travels in Japan and kawaii style. There's worldwide shipping to any country in the world. birthday messages for anime characters with a cute little van <laughs> oh, look there's the creepy roller coasters from my video this shop soft map is good if you want to buy new games. There's a couple of them around and they have this in Akihabara as well. And there's a big bank of gachapon outside. Here's the floor guide. Games consoles, video games, comics, Blu-rays. Oh, they got a floor of figures. Adult PC games. And some event rooms. <laughs> they have parties there. <laughs> Are they as much as in the UK? The Amiibos are a thousand yen, which is about seven pound fifty. Here's Super Potato, it's a retro game shop. They've got one in Akihabara as well. Like £3.50, £7, not a lot. <laughs> so far we've not really seen that many figure shops, we've seen a lot of arcades with UFO catchers and video game machines. Uh, but and some shops with sort of merch and manga and things but not that many figures and we haven't seen any of the glass cabinet shops where people rent the cabinets to sell their second hand figures and they always tend to be the best ones in my opinion but we just found Kotobukiya which is one of the best figure shops for well that I think so <laughs> for high quality figures they always have some really nice ones I think that might be a glass cabinet store there ah maybe it's too soon it might be just displayed oh yeah it looks like it might be
we've got coloured bins, trash box and ladders. <laughs> We just went into Animate. It's a really big shop with lots of merch. They had all clear files and little plushies and accessories and things. And I didn't realise that Animate had artist goods in there. They had a big selection of marker pens and things. And they also had Wacom tablets out for you to try, which is really good because you don't often get to do that when you want to buy a new tablet. I just had to guess which one to get because I couldn't try them out anywhere. Although they do have it, they do have them at MCM Comic Con in London on the Wacom stand quite often. This looks like a lot of gachapon in a shop. <laughs> Amusement Land Main Street. Over there's the Osaka branch of May Dreaming. I've seen quite a few maid cafes around. Here's a map of some shops around Denden Town. The Otterload shop map. Right, I think we've looked around the whole of Denden town now. It's kind of hard to tell because the shops are kind of dotted around and they're all in the back streets so you have to hunt for them. It's not like in Akihabara where it's wall to wall anime merch shops and arcades, but there is certainly a lot more anime stuff here than anywhere else probably. <laughs> and they do have all sorts of things. There's a lot of um, trading cards if you're into them. Um, a lot of general anime merch, possibly more anime merch than I've seen in Akiba. Um, there's some figures, there's lots of arcades with UFO catches and games to play. There are actually more shops than I expected. When I'd heard about how the shops are dotted around, I thought there might be like five or six places, but there's actually way more than that. And I had heard that Denden Town is a lot cheaper than Akihabara, but I'm not sure if that's the case. Um, I'm talking about for figures, anime figures. The prices I've seen seem pretty similar. It is hard to say because I haven't been to Akihabara for quite a while now and I will be going there soon and then I'll be able to compare properly. But it seemed about the same prices to me. I did see one Maki-chan figure, the one I bought from Love Live, uh, for 2,600 yen and I bought her for more like, I think 1,500 or 1,200 yen. So she was actually more expensive and she's older now unless she's become more rare, I don't know. <laughs> I didn't buy anything today because we are going to be going to Akihabara in a few days and there is a lot more variety there. I found that here I've seen the same animes and franchises come up again and I guess they must just be the popular ones at the moment. So if you're looking for something a bit more obscure or something in particular, you might not find it here. Um, so Akiba or Nakano Broadway would be a better place to hunt for really specific things. But if you just like anime in general or if you're in Osaka and you like anime and want to buy merch and figures, this is definitely the place to come. All these streets we've been walking around are in the area east of Namba Parks Mall and it's just south of Dotonbori. You can walk there pretty easily from Dotonbori. So we've spent a couple of hours here and I'd say a couple of hours is a good time, up to half a day probably. We didn't look in massive detail so if you want to make sure you've looked around everything and scoured every corner for that figure you want, you might want to spend a bit longer. I, I think we saw everything, it's kind of hard to tell but we saw most things definitely. 